of tax experts at audits firm Pricewaterhouse have encouraged government to support the agri sector through targeted policy. The advice comes on the back of abysmal performance by the sector. Now, despite key interventions, the sector grew by 2.6% by third quarter 2019. The provisional performance for tax revenue for the first nine months was 29 billion Ghana cities, compared to a programmed amount of 32.4 billion Ghana cities, a 10.4% shortfall of the target. According to the PwC, this adverse performance variance accounts for about 61.9% of the shortfall in domestic revenues. PwC says if government intends to meet its targeted tax revenues, it must review the benchmark values, pass the tax exemption bill and introduce strategies to rope in the informal sector. If you indeed are keen on raising taxes from the society, we currently have six bands. Having six bands is not easy to calculate, even for a consultant. Imagine the woman at Mokola, are you asking her as an employer to withhold from payment? That will not happen with your six bands. So we need to have a conversation around those six bands. PwC, in its analysis, further called for a restructuring of the tax system to avert this ill fate that has been a bane to the economy. For everyone, person who pays tax in Ghana, there's 17 people in the informal sector who are not. That's not a sustainable model. We're talking about people who are potentially running hotels and not paying taxes, people who have restaurants and not paying taxes, and so on and so forth. Now that goes hand in hand with simplifying the tax system, hence the presumptive tax rates. So you can't expect somebody who has no knowledge about accounting and tax to do all those calculations, get audited financial statements, and calculate tax. You need to make it simple for them.